Good evening. The Fremantle Dockers are in turmoil tonight with a second player in trouble with the law. The club revealing that Shane Yarren had been charged with aggravated assault. Teammate Michael Johnson is already under investigation over an incident at a kebab shop in Leaderville. A fired up Michael Johnson in Leaderville in the early hours of Sunday morning. These exclusive pictures show the docker defender held back by a group of four people, including his wife, ripping off his suit jacket. It's not long before police arrive on the strip. Leaderville is lit, fam. Johnson's accused of punching two men inside the Leaderville kebab shop after he was filmed with his trousers down. <laughs> there he is. There he is. The 32-year-old could now face police charges as they investigate the incident. Training with teammates in Fremantle this morning, the focus was on him until another bombshell rocked the club. Fellow docker Shane Yarren charged by police over an alleged domestic violence incident. Both Johnson and Yarren had been out celebrating the wedding of teammate Jonathan Griffin on Saturday night. Police allege the following day they were called to a house in Hammond Park where Yarren is accused of assaulting his partner and mother of his child. The 27-year-old has a criminal past. He was only in court four months ago after pleading guilty to disorderly conduct and failing to obey police following a drunken clash with officers in Leaderville. He copped an $800 fine. Shane, is there any apology you'd like to offer the public? Back then, the magistrate said alcohol was a trigger for Yaron's bad behaviour and urged him to get his drinking under control. The Dockers threw the recruit a lifeline in November last year after he was jailed for six years for aggravated burglary. We always support the person and challenge the behaviour, so we believe he's a good person who um, has had some challenges, is building his life and um, trying to redeem himself. Obviously, it's a tremendous honour to, to get the opportunity to put on the purple jumper. I'm really excited. Fremantle says it's treating the allegation with the utmost seriousness and will continue to monitor the legal process closely. The club has reported this latest common assault matter to the AFL. And Ebony Ferranda is at police headquarters tonight. Ebony Shane Yarren now has a legal battle ahead of him. Tim, police have confirmed that Shane Yarren has been charged with aggravated common assault. He says he'll plead not guilty to the charge. He's due to face the magistrate's court next month and will resume pre-season training with the Dockers next week. Now, as for Michael Johnson, police say they get to lay any charges. They're calling for any witnesses to that leadable incident to come forward. Emmy? Ebony, thank you.